Hi everybody, this is Roxy, and I have a second cookbook made from a um, Better Homes and Garden. It was in pristine condition, but I still wanted to cover it. So I used uh, Country Kitchen, oops, from Echo Park. Let me grab it here. And it's Stephen Duncan is the designer. And he used to be the designer at uh, October afternoon. So anytime I see some of their stuff, I gotta grab it. Um, but I love his take on things and his colors that he uses, just awesome. So the covers take two of each of the same paper. And in the Echo Park kits, you get two of each one, so that helps. And I just used the daisy. I did do my usual technique for decoupaging because I do kind of have a little um, trick that I think other people probably use too. But in case you're not aware of it, it perfectly decoupages um, paper down. And especially this thicker, it works great. So I use the same kind of um, concept that I did with the last one that I learned from coffee, paper, scissors, Stephanie. And I used another, these are pockets from Smead. I think they're DVD pockets or CD, whatever. And then I just cut out stuff. This is all cutouts. These are cutouts, I should say. This one I designed on my silhouette and threw one of those in and then just punched out some cute little circles just for looks. Okay, and then I used belly bands instead of the apron tie that I did for the last cookbook. And I included um, one of these cards that kind of matched the colors. And then I made a tag using some different helpful hint stuff and some old Tyrolean ribbons that I have and then just added a few um, recipe cards. And these are all, the little decoration on the front, that's all from the kit. And then I included some recipes in here. And I collaged on the back <clears throat> using um, pages from this cookbook. This one, these were just cutoffs, so I just glued them down like a little strip collage kind of thing. These are old coupons I have, some um, from the kit, little stickers, and then old, like, people cut off. I think it's from a newspaper or magazine, I don't know. But there it's old stuff. Another one. They're all basically the same. And then I included three recipe sheets, which you get four recipes on each one. And another collage. I also made a couple bookmarks. So it's pretty much the same as the last book. Um, there's some, all the recipe cards are vintage. <clears throat> Can't you tell it's October afternoon-ish? I love it. And here's another tag I made with more recipe cards. Another coupon. And then these are just um, holes from this punching out the, you know, the ring binding holes. And I just added some for a little color. Another bookmark. <clears throat> I love that. 
super cute. I like how this one turned out a lot. And mainly because of the Stephen Duncan aspect of it. And then another. These were kind of simple but fun to make. And another one of my um, to-do lists that I made on the silhouette. And that is this paper. I just found it, I think it was on, um, I don't know if I bought the package, the digitals too, I can't remember. This was a while ago that I made these. And there's that. The end. So I will put, I did some filming of the tags.